What's the formula to convert ML to MG? Hello, everyone. Today, we're diving into an often confusing topic, converting units of measure, specifically from milliliters, ML, to milligrams, MG. Keep in mind, these conversions are not as straightforward as they seem because they involve different types of measurements, volume, ML, and weight, MG. Understanding the units, ML and MG. First, let's understand what these units represent. Milliliters, ML, is a unit of volume in the metric system. It's commonly used in chemistry and medicine to measure small quantities of liquids. On the other hand, milligrams, mg, is a unit of mass, which we often casually refer to as weight. It's used in the metric system to measure very small amounts of a substance, usually solids but also liquids in certain contexts. Understanding these units and the types of measurements they represent is crucial because it reveals why we can't directly convert ml to mg without some additional information. The concept of density. To convert from a volume measure to a mass measure, we need to introduce another concept, density. Density is a measure of mass per unit volume. It's often measured in gram per milliliter or kilogram per cubic meter. The density of a substance varies depending on the substance itself. For instance, the density of water is approximately 1 gram per milliliter or 1,000 kilogram per cubic meter. The conversion formula. Now, let's get to the actual conversion. Given the density of the substance, the formula to convert milliliters to milligrams is mass mg equals volume ml density milligram per milliliter. So, you see, the exact conversion from ml to mg depends on the density of the specific substance you're dealing with. Without that piece of information, a direct conversion is impossible. And that's a wrap on converting milliliters to milligrams. I hope this video has helped clarify this topic. Remember, it all comes down to understanding the units and the role of density. Keep practicing, and soon this will all feel second nature. Thanks for watching, and happy calculating!